All right, then pink to the fu- pink to the future. What is gracious professionalism to your team? Well, mainly everything, I think. Oh wow. I mean, gracious professionalism for us is what makes us connected, what makes the first community such a nice, open hearted community. Because like it doesn't matter if you're at FLL Junior or FRC, everyone is just gracious to each other and you think that's so beautiful. And like when we were at Worlds, it's just like you're just friends with everyone and it's just so important to be gracious to be respectful to each other and sometimes when the matches are getting you know it's getting serious you know everyone's a bit nervous it's so important to still stay gracious towards your referees and everything and sometimes that can be difficult but i think gracious is just what makes it such a nice competition yeah yeah like if you're gracious it makes the competition better for everyone around you but also for yourself because when you're like nice to everyone and you have to like um you have to remind that like maybe you're playing against the teams but you're like together in this competition so you have to be like nice and like work together to get like the best game possible and to get the best competition possible so, yeah, I guess so. yes, like oh yeah i wanted to say that like um if you're against a team on one match, they could be like your alliance on the other match. So it's important just to stick to the to defend everyone because if you're like really mean to your <laughs> to the other alliance and they're your team in another match, that's just not gonna work. Yeah, it's not gonna work out. And one thing too, when you submit your video judging, make sure you mention video some sort of gracious professionalism, an example your team has done or what you think it does, because as I said, that's the embodiment of person, that's a requirement for any award. I mean, it's easy when you're doing you know, in-person judging, but if you're gonna be doing you know, remote judging, give an example of what you've done as a team. That's really, really important because there's nothing worse than get in front of uh, the team as a judge and you ask what great professionalism means and you see blank stares. You know, so have, have something, I'm sharing your laughing, that's happened to you before. So make sure you have, some example or just what an example or an explanation of what it is like you would just ask right there. And that's for the new teams that are listening. Make sure you come up with something. It's vital and important. And as I said, it's your body first. It's what all of us do. It's what all of us believe in. All right. And then next we'll have supposable thumbs answer. What is gracious professionalism to then? And then we'll turn it over to let the Ohio State talk about the robot in three days. All right. So to me, greatest professionalism is competing at our best while also helping everyone else compete at their best um, and like and helping uh, enable people. My favorite example from this is it was in the, I believe it was the Wisconsin finals a couple of years ago. Uh, one of the teams we were competing against, their, I believe it was their power distribution module blew uh, right before the match. So we gave them a new one and helped them uh, install it so they could actually compete against us in like the deciding match of that tournament um and it was all we wanted to have a fair match and we wanted them to be able to show what they could do um even though it necess- wouldn't necessarily benefit us in any way yeah gracious professionalism is so important because without like if we didn't have that the first community wouldn't be so open and it wouldn't be for 